Am I petting? No. Okay. <laughs> I'm getting hot, so I'm checking. This shirt's much less revealing than yesterday's. Hey, everybody. This is Randy Santel, Atlas, and I am very, very excited tonight. I'm going for overall win number 891. It is my third challenge in a row with these fine people. I've already had them introduce themselves in the last two, so I'll do it today. But we've got Raina Wong from California, and then from Canada. What part of Canada? I uh, currently live in Ontario. We've got Mr. Joel Hansen, or Model versus Food. We are all in Sugar Hill, Georgia, which is to the northeast of Atlanta. We've got lots of people here, which is much appreciated. We are at Daddy O'Brien's Irish Ice Cream Pub, where the first three people to take on Daddy O'Brien's Shepherd's Pie Challenge, which is topped off with their Motherload Challenge, which is an Irish uh, ice cream challenge that they've had, they've had it going for years. But we're the first to take on this. We're gonna start with all of this food here first, then they're gonna bring out our ice creams. Daddy O'Brien's here, they're known for their actually alcohol-infused ice cream. I think it'll be my first time trying that, but we've got 30 minutes to finish all of this, plus the ice cream, which is gonna be 12 scoops. We'll explain that in a little bit, but we've got five portions each of their shepherd's pie, which is made with beef, but we've got, I think, corn on the bottom, there's some garlic mashed potatoes, there is beef, and then it's all topped with a whole bunch of cheese, and then we each have five portions of their green beans, so we're gonna start with these. If we fail this entire challenge, it's gonna be $85, but if we win, we'll get our meals free, we'll get sweet t-shirts to add to our collections, we'll get Daddy O'Brien's souvenir mugs to take home, and we're hoping to be the first three people up on the wall of fame. Let's get this challenge started. <laughs> All right, big thank you to Daddy-O and Mommy-O here at Daddy O'Brien's in Sugar Hill, Georgia. But we've got 30 minutes to finish. We're all gonna have to hurry through this because I think there's like two and a half pounds of ice cream, but six of the scoops, I think for Joel's six, all 12 for me, are infused with alcohol. But two of them, there's gonna be three flavors of each. We each got four, I think, different flavors. But there's gonna be Legends Distillery products a vodka and a bourbon, and those will have Chris from Legends Distillery explain that while we're eating. But let's shut up and eat, dominate. One, two, three, boom! All right. All of the shepherd's pie is about three pounds total. Oh, Delicious, wow. healthy green beans. Holy crap. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Back with a vengeance after last night's challenge. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, she's so beautiful. This is stupid good. Oh my god. Alright, I'm gonna work on catching up. No, I'm just kidding. It's amazing. I'm gonna finish third and I'll have everybody cheer for me then. <laughs> oh my god, on her last yeah. Is her ice cream ready? Oh my god, yes, yeah. yes, yeah. ice cream! Mine were heavier. <laughs> Delicious flavors that I am savoring and enjoying. This ice cream? Oh my god. Oh my god. The best thing ever. They've been touring together, so Joel knew this was going to happen. All part of the strategy. <laughs> Randy actually knows. Uh, yes, Mommy O is actually going to come over here and explain the flavors that Raina got and then the flavors that Joel got. I just had that burger. Raina has <laughs> vanilla, cotton candy, strawberry. Joel has butterbeer and 
yes, the Legends bourbon and cookie butter pecan, one of my favorites. Uh, and they, on the bottom is a piece of Amari's homemade chocolate cake and all of our toppings. He's got two sets of alcoholic and two sets of none? Yes. Yes, okay. And then all mine are alcoholic. That's going to be coming in a little bit. That's not saying man is an alcoholic. He just has the alcoholic. We are at an Irish place, so we've got to have some alcohol. Can we get seconds too? Followed by a Guinness <laughs> after. Keep in mind, we're only four minutes and 50 seconds in. Marina, don't let him stretch out. He's stretching out. I can't do ice cream. That's it. <laughs> Joel, you might have a chance. <laughs> I'm just enjoying this. Whatever happens, happens. I'm in heavenly bliss. Patronize me, I'm doing pretty good. <laughs> yeah. Healthy green beans. There's some more of that bourbon. Woo! <laughs> ah. Seven minutes and 38 seconds for all of mine. Switcheroo and not knock out Raina. There we go. All right, and then Joel is just finishing up. Let's go, Joel. going to be yummy and the reason I'm not rushing is because this is actually their mother load challenge they have here. You get 20 minutes to finish it as a food challenge. A lot of people finish between 10 and 15 minutes and you get a free t-shirt you still pay for the meal but always good to get a sweet t-shirt. <laughs> That's why hey, I might need some warm water. Warm water? Yeah this ice cream is cold believe it or not. I don't mean to get into food science, but isn't this ice cream colder because it has alcohol in it? Yes, sir. There we go. I learned something in school. And then Joe and I had martini glasses, and Raina has a regular bowl because it only had two. And no alcohol. No, I have no alcohol. I wasn't going to tell them that. But... No, I was going to say, if you win, I was going to blame it on you not having alcohol. <laughs> if I told them I don't drink, they'd know I'm lying. I wasn't involved with the topping picks, but whoever picked them, I think it was Joel, did great. This is awesome. There's even Lucky Charm marshmallows. We even have a Lucky Charm ice cream. Guys, groundbreaking. Lucky Charms ice cream. Remember that seconds I talked about? He did have like four churros after the uh, Mexican food challenge the other day. Two. Moderation. <laughs> Raina, how you doing? Cool. 14 minutes in. Sure cool. Alright, we're 15 minutes in, halfway through. Chris with Legends Distillery is going to come over and help explain the vodka and the bourbon that we're eating in this ice cream. And by we, I mean I. So we're at a distillery down the road in Cumming, Georgia, and we make award-winning vodka and bourbon. There's no burn with our product at all. It is ultra smooth, ultra pure. We have a patented technology called Quantum Purity, and what it does is it reduces the consciousness in alcohol leading to the toxins by 50%. So you get the full flavor of the vodka and the bourbon, but we're reducing the toxins that essentially give you a handover. We'll see how I feel tomorrow, whether he's right or wrong. No handover. He's going to take back the morning. Well, hey, thanks for being here. We appreciate it. 50% less toxins, 
less mouth burn, full feeling, and full deliciousness. <laughs> okay. This stuff kicks. Raina finished in 16 minutes and 55 seconds. Great job, to Raina. Tell us what you thought of it. Oh, it was very good. I'm just so bad at eating ice cream. But it was very, very creamy and I love the pain. And I love the shepherd's pie. I should be proud of Yes, you really enjoyed that. <laughs> now that they've finished, I can turn on the afterburners and get done. <laughs> and he was a gentleman who was really waiting for us to <laughs> Oh, we're getting there, almost there. We're 19 minutes and 8 seconds in. I've been tasting a bunch of the Lucky Charms marshmallows, and they are good. Adding really good texture to all this ice cream. As Joel always says, leave no doubt. Second, the number three time for Daddy O'Brien's challenge here at Daddy O'Brien's Irish Ice Cream Pub here in Sugar Hill, Georgia. I think all three of us really enjoyed the cake that was in this thing. Along with, I've got to say my favorite part was that shepherd's pie. Loved it. Delicious meal. So we are each going to get the $85 meals for free. If you want to take on this mother load challenge, it's 25 bucks, and then 60 of it came from all of the shepherd's pie and the green beans. But we're going to get our meals free. We're going to get sweet t-shirts, dead dark collections, and we'll be the very first three people up on the wall of fame for beating this challenge. So big thank you to Mommy O and Daddy O here at Daddy O'Brien's Irish Ice Cream Pub in Sugar Hill, Georgia. For me, it was overall win number 891, one of many for Raina, and then number 214 for me. Yes, so this was my third and final challenge with them, so thanks to them for doing the challenge. I think they had that home this weekend, but thank you guys for watching.